Hi, welcome to Singapore Business Supplies instructional video series. I'm Ronald and I'd like to share with you about setting up glider with the Futama 16SZ, 16IZ and the 18SZ. This channel has received many comments and encouragements. I'd like to thank you for your kind words and we're here today to answer your questions. In this video, we're going to reply to Robert and this is his question. How do we set up battery telemetry alarm on transmitter? Robert, this episode is to answer this question and I'm sure many of you also have this similar question. This is how we do it. Our setup today is with the 16IZ and the R7108 receiver. In the linkage menu, we will find the telemetry and we will see the under receiver, we have the battery and the external battery. Now external battery is actually connected to the 7108 receiver through the micro con connector at the end of the receiver. For today's demonstration, we will only be focusing on the voltage that goes to the receiver. The setup is exactly the same. Okay, So, we get into the receiver and we will see the battery currently and external battery. So, Going into the battery setup, we tap this voltage. Alright, and you will see the selection available. Now, we turn on the power supply, and currently it is at 6.4. The transmitter will also show 6.4. The number here is the minimum voltage that it has experienced on the receiver so we can erase it by tapping it so at 6.4 we tap into this all right now these are the setup that we can choose if the voltage falls below the threshold limit all right we can choose the alarm to be buzzing or we can have a voice read out to us the vibrator has three settings we can set type 1 which is a long vibration medium length and short pulsing vibration so this is the limit that we can set so by default it's 4 volt we can perhaps set it as if it's 2 cell lipo maybe we can set it to 6.6 okay warning battery 6.4 ah. volt warning battery So, current voltage is 7.1. As you heard earlier, the vibration began because it has fallen below 6.6 .6 that we set up. So, I shall demonstrate once more when I reduce the voltage from 7.1 to below 6.6. .6. Okay, 6.5. Immediately, the transmitter... So when it falls below 6.6, .6, the readout and the vibration will come. So this is how we set up the battery telemetry alarm. Last but not least, I'd like to also explain about the speech option. By default, speech option is off. The reason why it is here and I think it is sometimes important is because when we fly our models, we're looking at the model in the sky. So there are times where we wish to know what is the voltage on the battery right now. It also tells us how much time we have as we fly or how many more power bursts we can have on the battery. So this is where we go in and if I would like to choose a switch that I don't normally use which is switch B, I can assign it to switch B and I set the switch on in the second and third position. Okay. So once I've done that, you will see current voltage is 7. If I bring the switch B down to second of position, Battery, 7 .0, oh, 7 .0. it reads out what that voltage is. And this can be set up for the receiver battery or the external battery. So if you continue to leave it on, Battery, it will continue to read out. 
We hope this session was helpful to you. Please like and share our videos if you enjoyed this session. For more upcoming helpful videos, do subscribe to our channel and keep your comments coming. Thank you for watching.